you are taking your man. Both of you are taking the you piss. You are actually Yo, bad. Do you know what we just said? He just said, yeah, wait. Did you say that Onana, yeah, Onana is a better person than Edison? Oh my are God. Are you lost? You two are lost. What? You two are actually lost. This guy has oh, been drinking some <laughs> alcoholic beverages. I can't take off my own top. But you're, you're telling me. You're, t- oh. you're telling me. You're telling me. Welcome back, guys, to what will be the most exas no oh, exasperating in the world Yay. exhilarating mm. i'd say could be probably one of the most tense episodes we are going to record this year i'm here it's a bit chilly in it but we'll get to that in a sec it's pretty cold today it's really isn't chilly it? it's a bit cold isn't it? i'm here with the man himself eddie the and general versia and i'm here with sam my assistant uh, a lot of magic <laughs> Wow. And I'm Demi, and welcome back to another episode of the DES podcast. Um, where do we start? Where do we start? Oh, Sam, 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 Sam. What happened? No, no, yeah. I don't even want to say anything. What happened? Just tell us what genuinely happened. Do you want to? It's actually very simple. It's very, very simple. Uh, first of all, both teams were shit, um, uh, and we can both agree that. And uh, but I still think the football that we played was still better than Arsenal and Manchester City's game. I still think it was much more exciting than that. Uh, what? As the whole game as a whole, or just uh, the football my United played? As in the football match, if you are neutral. Okay, watching, so the football match was more exciting than the match that City and Arsenal. Game. Oh yeah, definitely. Oh yeah, I can agree with yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that, that, that match is probably the match of the season. That like. that match. What match? I say Liverpool's one was better. Which one? Um, I I won the Liverpool one in the cup. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was Liverpool. What about the one that Chelsea played against City? Like, you know, that's probably the match season. Well, you do you think that's the match of the season? I genuinely thought match of the season was going to be Spurs against Arsenal. Well, but two, they draw two. two well. Yeah, but we drew four four to City. Like, to be honest, I don't even know what match of the season could be this season. You have that. Okay, let's think of match of the season. Okay, we have the, we have the Spurs and. Chelsea, we have the Spurs and City game. Yeah, that was a good game. We yeah. have Spurs and City game. We have the Liverpool United game. Right? Liverpool United game. Um, what other matches there? Obviously, we have the match. Yes, um, Chelsea versus Man United. It was a bit cold there, but what can we do? <laughs> I won't lie, it's actually very cold. The wind, there's a storm outside. Yeah, I can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's probably going to be hard for me. Like, I have to edit all this wind out in the background. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah. going to be annoying. And what other match? What else was match of the season this season? There was a few good games. Sure, I even I had the one with uh, City and Chelsea because that's the one that got the the Lion of England or of London. Who's uh, the Lion of London? Um, pa- Palmer. And um, remember that um, flag, and it was just walking, and the way it was just flapping in the background. Do you remember that picture, or is it just me? It's just you. I won't lie. I don't know what you're talking about. It was after the Man City game. Um, I look for it and put it somewhere. Yeah, but um, what was match of the season? <laughs> I don't think we have had it. We'll wait until the season ends, like. Yeah, but like, I don't think you're gonna get that anymore. Like, what is? What because is? now it's people are playing to win. Like, you know the top three teams now. See you, how Arsenal played against you, City. Like, you get it. Though. They were nonsensical. They were that was the most boring game of the season. They were playing by for far. a draw. Oh yeah, they were playing for a draw. Oh, they, they, they won't say, but they were playing. They were, they were scared when they. They were, were there. terrified because you have. To, they had to do that against mm. City. Because if you know, like, it's like someone actually. But you know the thing is, yeah. Arsenal played a very smart game against City. Yeah. Mm. As boring as it was, they were like, we're not going to play at your own game because we know you're going to win. We're not gonna yes. let you so we're going to play our game, but yeah. I won't lie to you. Saliba and Gabriel, yeah. Haaland was in that back pocket. I'm shift Saliba away from that. Gabriel specifically. You know, Fip, you know I hate Arsenal, but Fip, that guy's transformation has been crazy. Top. Gabriel was top. Remember, remember last season, like, this was someone that they wanted to get rid of. Yeah. Oh, and now the guy just yeah. came back out of was a st- I And mean, to be honest, he was. Saliba was, a, was, a, was just a couple notches of no, another level above uh, Gabriel. Can, can I ask you a question, though, before we're going to get back to the whole thing? Why do you think Saliba never starts for France? I just think the coach doesn't like him. Sure, the champ was saying that there's some stuff that he does that he doesn't like. Who but, starts for? But can you imagine France that now? he will see he will look at Saliba the way he plays every week, and then he will look at Upamecano well, and Upa say, Mekano "Let me and, and is he drunk?" I think as well. We also Kunde? Have, is it? Kun, I think it's Upamecano. Oh, Pabai. Oh, Kim Pibe when he's when he's oh, Kim Pibe, Pibe, yeah. yeah. I think as well. We also need to because we can't. We have to also be very um. What's the English? 
the very um, wise, I guess, for lack of a better term, in and how we're assessing this because we don't watch Bundesliga uh, week in week out. We don't, we don't see because most of the time we actually ever seen uh, Upamakane is when they, <laughs> they show the videos. Upamakane, Upamakane, <laughs> Upamakane, when, when, <laughs> when like because so, it can actually when the lights are sl- are slapped onto his head here, the guy just starts getting one serious bozo gene that activates. But well, he's it, actually decent. Like he's not, he's, he's bad. He's just a, no. Me, but what Haaland did to Upamakane. Should not should that just, just finish it there? Man. What you just did to him there? Just, just finish it there. It's it's what you did to that guy last year? Well, Pumacano is actually quite good on the ball. He's actually quite good on the ball. What is he for? He is. I don't know. I don't know. Really wa- like if you actually, I, I, I've, I've tuned in here and there whenever I can't. But anytime I see him, Pumacano is actually really. The only reason reliable. why I ever watch Byron play, I don't even care. It's just to watch Kane. <laughs> That's I, I really, I don't care about anybody. Else. Man, man, Musiala, Musiala, like, Musiala. Huh? Musiala, nah, that, I that just stayed to watch Kane. I know Musiala's feet. See, the thing of the everybody know everybody by now who has been keeping up with this pod has to know. I have a as much as I hate Kane, I have a special place in my heart for him. My thing about Kane is I don't look at players because I look at the way the guy sees the game. That's the way I look at Kane. Like he sees like that was the season that he, there was a season pass on pass, he was better than Kevin De Bruyne. Mm. Don't 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 be quiet there. You know yourself. There was a season. <laughs> did he not get like most assists and most goals one season? As long as the season before Harry came in. Yeah, ha- no season Harry came. Remember something like that. Mm. So like that's why I said there was a season. This guy was system better than KDB. But obviously KDB is the guy of everybody. I'm not going to deny that one. <laughs> yeah. but, today as well. The silence said <laughs> One. That goal shaved, you know he shaved me. You know. Yeah. I was just like, my KDB has been off it this year, man. I didn't just did I just mm. I literally when I said. And just before b- before we came here, it's one nil Crystal Palace. I was like, ah, look at look at them. Where is KDB? Where is KDB? In my head, I was seeing it. And then look at this idiot. He went to go and score. Then he went to go and score again and assist. I was like, what's going on? This guy is wicked. You can't ah, write wicked. off KDB, man. That, they had him in the hydro chamber. Okay, is Harry Kane the best striker you've seen with your eyes? Oh, we are going to that conversation fully. You want to go to that conversation already? Yeah. So you don't want to slag him. We were sl- bro, I'm just you know you have to build it up. Isn't it? Is Harry Kane the best striker that I've that. ever seen? With your eyes, yes, yes. Because do you know why I'm gonna say that? I haven't really like as much as like I know there's the way Rooney's. When you say have I seen plays different mm. to, to is he the best striker? When you ask me who is the best goalkeeper I've ever seen, I've seen. Mm. Because during between when people say this person is the best goalkeeper, but ask oh, me who I've seen, see, yeah. who I've seen, yeah. like the best, one of the best, who's the best goalkeeper I've seen? Okay, let's go strike. I Harry Kane's probably the best striker I've seen in my eyes. So you put him over Suarez? Yeah. Mm. You think Harry Kane is better than Suarez? Bro, the only reason why we don't call Harry Kane World Class because he has no trophies. That is simply it. Yeah, I, but, I, but for, forget even if, just forget that for a second. If we take trophies out of the if equation, take, if you take ability. trophies out oh, of the ability, oh, Harry Kane, hundred oh. percent over it. As a wait, are we talking? Let's let's you know this argument we have all the time, but we need to we need to dissect because it because I'm it, not saying not, not as a like as an overall player because it's like okay let me let me ask you a question mm-hmm. is Highland the best striker you've ever seen? <laughs> God forbid. But is Highland one of the best goal scorers you've ever seen? Yes. yes. See, that's what I say. We have to be careful. The way we word the question. I mean, See, I'm saying, like, I'm saying, as a striker, right? As a like, striker, all attributes together. As all, ad- if we, all attributes together has to be Kane, bro. So we build up playing. Like, Sa- see, Sam, that's, that's Sam, Sam. See, that's the thing. No, over Suarez. No, Sam. Oh, in general. Over, 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 if we're talking about complete player now, it's going to be Kane. Come on. Because no, because see, Kane has a good pass, right? And good finishing. And good finishing, of course, there. And I don't know if he, is he dead. Is he dead ball good? I'm not, is, dead it, is, it, is dead ball good? Yeah. I'm asking. I'm not, I'm not saying anything. So I'm saying that Suarez. Why is Suarez better than Kane? That's the question I want to ask. Because of the way he built up. Do we so Kane doesn't build up. I didn't say. I didn't so say, Kane and Son didn't I, have wait to wait to wait to. Let me talk. Did I talk? say? Did, did I say that his build up was bad? Is I'm it, just saying it's the way Suarez built up for me. So is Suarez's build up better than Kane's? I would say so. Hey God, you know the reason why you, 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 that, that even becomes part of an argument is because Suarez was in that um, MSN. At, but that just uh, that shouldn't matter. We're talking about. We're, no, I'm no, literally no, talking I, about. I, the I, I, but yeah, then you have to remember that Kane and Son had the best what a as a duo, the mm, best in English history. Yeah, English. So, yeah. It, well, now, well, now, there's. But see, there's I don't like see that argument. I don't like it between. <laughs> I don't like it between Kane and Suarez because, it one, one hand, you're gonna say Kane is better just because this guy, does. 
crazy things. He's just he just doing crazy things. Even mm. in Bayern Munich, so many things he's doing there are just out of this world. Yeah. But then I obviously not gonna forget Barcelona Suarez and Liverpool Suarez. Even Liverpool Suarez is the one but I have the most crazy. Wow. So I don't think we can compare the two. Yeah, I just don't think we can because regardless of anything, whatever you want <clears> to say, <throat> everybody will say that Suarez has more <clears throat> trophies than Kane. That's why it's better. I'm not but now, if we take trophies, you're asking me again from my own <laughs> eyes. Ujumi, who is the best striker I've ever seen? I it has test. to be Harry Kane. I test. But fuck the trophy talk. I test. Pure I test alone. Like, pure I test alone. It has, to be, Harry it has of, to be Harry Kane. Fuck all the other shit that we see. As we've all played football at varying levels throughout our lives here. On top of that, and then what we see with our eyes as well. Just to try to... um And just with that. I think it has to be Harry Kane. Like, see, if, I, if I'm if i looking at it, who would I want to play with on the pitch, right? I would pick Suarez. No, I'd pick Kane. 100% I'd pick And Suarez. again, picking Kane depends on the type of player you are. Because mm. a winger is going to want Kane all day, yeah, every day. I would love Kane because like Kane would pop in. But if, you're, but, if you're a, but if you're a winger, is going to want Kane all day, every day. Yeah. But a 10 <laughs> is probably going to want Suarez, Suarez all day, yeah. every day. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. they both play... It depends different. how you see the game as well. Like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, we're still, leaving, we're still, we're still leave, leaving out, like... Aguero, there's also Aguero. Yeah. <laughs> who did you say? Who did, which, who did you compare again uh, before we started the podcast? Uh, was it Aguero and Rooney? That's it, Rooney and Salah. Rooney and Salah and Aguero and who? Aguero and you compared Aguero to somebody. I think it was on United. Oh, Aguero, you, you compare Aguero with somebody. I'm trying to remember who you compared Aguero with. Is that when you shouted? Yeah. Uh, you compared Aguero with somebody and I can't remember. I who. think it was Rooney. You compared Aguero with Rooney. Mm-hmm. He compared. Yaya and um, Roy Keane. <coughs> eh? <laughs> wait, who did he say is better? He said Yaya was better. Hey, oh, no, Chineke, I agree. Wait. No, no wait, wait, I agree. <laughs> wait, no. I didn't even answer the question, so that's a lie, you know. Oh, wait, that's so, a lie. Oh, wait. Who's better? Who's better? Why is it? No, because wait. I didn't really see Roy Keane, but I still say Yaya. Who's better, Roy Keane or Yaya? My problem, my problem <laughs> is that... Wait, 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 yeah, because I do believe I want to put this out there before I give my answer. I do believe that when people talk about Roy Keane, and this is what I actually, from the bottom of my heart, I actually this is a part of the punditry from the United um, legends that when they talk here, yeah, the way they undermine themselves back from back when they used to play, because these niggas when they came onto the scene, Roy Keane was one of the most touted players in English football when he was playing in centre mid. He was, it's not just like ball bashing EJ. Like, the guy was a proper midfielder. Do you know what the problem is, Sam? I still pick Yaya, though. <laughs> Do you know? Because I've seen <laughs> Yaya. Yeah. I've, you know, I, I've seen Yaya. Bro. I've seen, no, it's because yeah. I've, I've, I've watched Yaya. I've yeah, really that's the I've, like, I've watched Yaya. Too. I've, watched I mean, way like, more, I, I've watched a lot. Of, I've watched Yaya Barca. I've watched Yaya and C- City. City. This is what, like, you know, when you're doing player comparison, like, um, one of the boys asked me the other day, Neymar or Bale, who would you pick? Bale. Thank you Neymar. very much. I said yeah. Bale as well. You said that when he, he, this guy is from Tottenham. No, but no, 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 no. Let's stop here. Let's just stop here. If you just forget about that, let's, for, for let's forget about everything. Like, let's just stop, bro. You're picking like Neymar. you are telling me right now. You got to name out over Bale. Demi. No, why? Now, I, the question. The one thing I want to ask. Where you do is, I play? Why? Demi, where do I play? I don't know. You play when I played play football, which was, was right back. So you have to remember. <laughs> that. That's what you no, no, because I, I I was feeling technically insecure <laughs> when I came back from football. Have in mind, yeah, it's because of this guy that I broke my jaw. First of all, yeah, I gave him a delicious ping. And, and I'm not gonna. The ball was ball good, but the bo- the problem with that ball it wasn't even your fault. It was just the weather. I said that. <laughs> it was just the weather. But imagine the why ball. Why did it drop like Super Mario? The ball. Imagine <laughs> the ball was bouncing here. Yeah. Ask me. It's like the. It's like some. It's like a. It's like the wind just came. I went vroom. The ball literally just j- went when we all jumped. Me, I got to back. <laughs> I haven't played football ever since. But I'll be back. Yeah. I'll be back playing that game soon. Uh, it's, a, it's an amazing game. But per- Demi, personally, yeah, because me, I play wing now. That's what I've been playing mm-hmm. for the past couple of years. You rather name her over Bale, bro? De- you know, you know, correct. You know, yeah. I rather name her over Bale. I love to play like Neymar, but I play more like. Let's say Bill. Let's say if there's a there's a why, Bill and Neymar, more like Bill, but I love to play more like Neymar. Well, why would you? Sorry, what you see the thing is, you you don't understand because Bill went from a left back Bro. to right wing. The way he struck that ball, same. I thought that that shit does never make sense. Saka went from a left back to right wing. Fucking. Are you going to compare the way Saka went, strike ball before? Fuck wait, that. Please. Fuck that. Fuck. Are you crazy? No. Ayo, you say what you no, said. Ayo, Samuel Ogutayo. 
He went from left back to the more where's he playing? He's playing wing now in fucking Chelsea. Okay. Let's but, stop this okay. thing about Sam, 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 Sam. You just use your you just use that 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 scoundrel Saka. You just Sam, said that no, no, to Bill. Garrett Bill. Sam, Are you don't, drunk? Sam, don't, don't Garrett Bill that's called bicycle kick in Champions League final. I'm trying to say yeah, uh, before you go and start just saying behold be the example. It's, it's not on the thing of it's unheard of. Listen, I'm not. Sorry, are you? I just want to make sure you're not comparing Bale and Saka. No, no, no. That's what I'm Thank saying. God. I'm Thank saying God. yeah. This <laughs> whole idea about oh coming from a fullback. Listen, f- um, position changes happen all the time. But I'm, I, I'm that not... shouldn't be an argument. Jolton, yeah, dropped from like this um, very very poor um, striker, striker to, to one of the best. Uh, uh, that means in this mid- mid- <laughs> like I, I don't. I, what type of midfielder is he? Is a box to box, box, box to box, Budoza, Dueler. Like and he's one of the, he's one of the best like I've seen is mm-hmm. in terms of when you're thinking about tens in in the I mean ten, box to box in the in the prem you're gonna have him in the in the better oh, yeah. half of the list mm-hmm. like what are we talk position changes happen the whole time but, yeah what are we talking about but Bale, my thing about the whole bail is why would you rather name out over bail because that sounds mad it's, to me it's it's honestly in terms of because me I'm I'm not even thinking about the trophies or that I'm thinking about pure I I'm talking about as I watch them yeah for me aesthetically yeah. Neymar is just the better, yeah, better player. Why would player. I want to? Sh- I, but the thing about Neymar is with me, is that and he's effective. This whole argument that he's not effective yet. Oh, he's not he? as effective as Bill. Okay. You know why? Why are you telling me? Like, okay, accolades wise, he's not. As I don't effective think there's. If we're gonna put start, if we're gonna put it, like the I guy who the was, season where Bill has had better stats than Neymar. Okay, but if we're gonna put who is the guy I'm going to want to put on a pitch when I need to get a goal and win something? Or to it's do something Bale. magical. It's Man, Bale. It's Neymar. I, it's okay, Neymar. Name, name, name me the moments. What do you mean? Name you the moments. If not for, if not for, um, if not for Brazil in and of himself, just being a te- at the time for the did not know how to calm down and kill a game here. Neymar would have carried Brazil, but that was pretty much into the final of that of that uh, World Cup at that time. Which time? Number when Neymar lost, scored that goal. Lost not when they lost seven one. When That's the one, most recent one. This no, the World Cup you're talking about is not the one when he got injured in his back. No, the, it's because he scored. He, he literally carried them and he, and he got to goal. I can't remember. Was it against Croatia? Was it? I, I can't. Sam, so. you said the World Cup. Was it? Was that World Cup or am I misremembering the? If the we're wo- talking about Dumont against Croatia, that's the most recent one that they lost two one, I think. And they needed to kill the game because no, I can't remember. I miss, I miss, I'm misslining it. But that was a moment. There was a moment where uh, Brazil ne- needed a goal. They, I think they went into extra time. They needed a goal. Yeah, Neymar pulled. He, I think he went to penalty. I got go to penalty shootout. If he went to penalty shootout, then it was Croatia. Oh, it wasn't try, that. It wasn't that was the most recent. Try one. talking to the mic a bit. It was. I don't think it was that. I think it was the one before that one. Well, I think it was the one before that one because Croatia went into the finals against France after winning that one. Croatia, I swear Croatia bet England, no? No, my memory is Yeah, you're confusing me. Yeah, you're yeah, confusing like, me, but like, let's not go off a tangent for a minute. So you're basically saying, like, do you know the amount of moments I could name that Gary Bale has turned up? What's that one, a classical? When you like, I can't, let me, I can't even start at Spurs, let alone, I can from, start from Spurs, I can go to Madrid, I can go to Wales. No, but like, you're telling me you want a player. Yes, we know he's, he's skillful, he's... I wonder if it's mostly his skill. Like, I don't really see Neymar. <laughs> I don't really... You know what, what, what I was saying to No, you but I'm earlier, just saying... Other than that he's extremely Irish here. Yeah. Demi as well. Is that part of him in football? Yeah, but he's like... extremely yeah, but, Irish. Listen, listen. Apart from Neymar dribbling, pace, passing... Pace. His pace is nowhere Bills. Let's not even put pace No, I don't, I don't. That's what I'm saying okay. about Bills. Bills, pace, shooting... Physicality and, and passing. And let's not make it look like Gary Bill can skill you. Because I've seen that guy do some mad things. Mm. Over Neymar. No, no, not Neymar. No, no, no. Not Neymar. No, no, no. Passing said, over Neymar. Okay. <laughs> Pass over Neymar. You can, you can say it's a draw. You can say it's a draw. Shoot him. Don't even, not even close. Just because of power shot, they're saying shoot I'm him. not finished. I'm, yeah, you said <laughs> In terms of variety of finishes, yeah. Really? Eh. <laughs> oh. do you, know, you know Bill can finish it with his head? He can finish it with his with the long shot, close shot, whatever. And you say variety of shoot. What do you mean? What are we talking about I now? Don't, I don't understand this level of argument that we're having. Neymar. Ne- really? Neymar. Neymar as in from Santos Neymar. As in people would tune in to watch fucking South American football. Neymar. That people on FIFA 13, yeah, would go and purposely play with Santos strictly because of Neymar. 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 
Santos Junior, Neymar. That is who you Sad Sandalo Kula. Hey! Hi, bro. Hi. Hi, bro. That's, that's the name. That's the player that you're comp... I'm not... And mind you, yeah, I'm not even... I'm not diminishing anything Gary Bale has done. God knows. Because in terms of um, wingers as well, but Gary Bale as well, in terms of... F when I say direct, effective, what wingers in England, adding a little bit of Spanish, because he did collect some Spanish stuff, yeah, in, in Spain, add a bit of that. Gary Bale is... Damn near pitch perfect. Pace, power, physicality. He has a athleticism. Yeah. Ball striking. He has that. Okay, but so I'm see, saying, all the, see all the things that you named there. Apart from dribbling, what does Neymar have have I'm above so, Bill? Did you not just listen to what I said as I was listening what that was? But that was under the category of what in terms of England's yeah, what they list and they want in a player. What's your argument though? You're literally I'm saying that. So you're when, saying that. And when I watch, when you watch, like I said, this is why I say I test. I'm not even adding the other. I'm saying specifically I test. When I watch wingers, yeah, the ones that make me fall in love with the position, the ones that make me love and it makes me love and enjoy the game, yeah, Neymar does that way more for me than Bill. That's what I'm saying. The way he moves. I'm not just talking about um, what's it? On ball movement, off ball movement, the little passes, the triangles. That, and you've seen it the most at Barcelona as well, with the way we interchange with ne uh, Suarez and Neymar. It was fucking. When I watch Neymar, yeah, honest to God, there's the same. When you see Messi play sometimes, yeah, there's a level of mystique sometimes in how he does it. It's like, how the fuck does he do this? The only other person I've ever really seen play, and I get the same level of mystique, I just magic when they play, is Neymar. So you don't get it from Ronaldo. From Ronaldo, mm. we said no. Actually, no. Some stuff from Ronaldo, I get. I was like, how? But how? Sorry, guys. We've been having some serious technical difficulties. My power just keeps going. On the blasted picture. What? Hmm. Did you say Barca winning two three? No, I said on the blasted picture. I know. Anyways, guys, getting away from the comparisons, let's talk about Thursday night. What happened, Sam? <sighs> Uh, like I was saying earlier, um, um, my shit, and we just happened to be shit for the pa for just the last three minutes, and um, the not a shit team went to go and um, punish, and uh, that's it. Who do you blame? Who do I blame? Um, I blame the players for not knowing how to kill a game because it's if I if I'm them, uh, it's three three. You take the three three. You, you obviously you fucked up. You absolutely take the mistake. You leave with something rather than with nothing. Listen, trying to score a fourth goal in the dying minutes while everybody is pushed off, yeah, a tip <coughs> when you could literally just kill the game and take and leave with something. Yeah. So you blame the players, right? Oh yes. There's I only. Th I think there's someone else you can blame as well. I think you could blame Tan Hag. And I'll tell you why. I have never heard Chelsea so loud this whole season. I haven't heard them loud at all until Mr. Mount came on. And the booze that that brother was getting, that's the loudest I've heard the Chelsea crowd this season. And I think that riled up all the players, Mount coming on. And that's what drove us to, like literally, I've never, this is the first time I've seen Chelsea fans actually celebrate properly with our manager celebrating this whole season. Mount, Mount literally fueled us up. If Mount didn't come on, I don't think he would have been fueled up like that. I promise you, I really don't. So I blame Tanag. I really thought that Mount's dad that was funny. <laughs> A man dagger would have fueled me for the rest of I the I have season. never seen even Edson Fernandez started on him. I fucking loved it. He's stupid. The, the guy that people are then people are saying, Oh yes, yes, of course I, I, I did South American loyalty. I'm like, you niggas know about South Americans. This oh, man, I fucking love this it. man betray like no tomorrow. Please <coughs> and thank you. Don't be booing that bullshit. Listen, even the guys, it seems like Nepal wants to be taking lights from me. I don't know what the problem is. I actually don't know what the problem is, to be honest. But that's very weird. That's the first time this has ever happened. Try. Because usually when shit like that happens, it means there's like a... Someone's plugged in something that's wet or there's like... Oh, yeah. 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 Can you close that door? Sorry, guys. It seems like my power just keeps going and coming, so we'll see what happens. Um, But yeah. What are we saying? Whose fault it was that United lost? I think it's just a mixture of everybody. I, I, think. I believe. And have you noticed there's this trend of United getting conceding the same goal consistently? No, oh, cutbacks. Cutbacks. You know Sky Sports is fucking put on TikTok. A competition. I think you sent it to me. Yeah. It's Ooh. actually pretty crazy the amount of times it's happened. You can't defend them. 
he can't defend them. It's like we're playing fucking um, <laughs> um, champs on Ultimate Team. He can't defend them. Why? Cut back every time. Why can't you not defend them? Ask, you're asking me. I'm, I should be asking I them. should be asking you. I don't know. I'm because not I'm pretty sure Martinez was there for a few of them. It was indeed. No, it was. I'm not, I don't know. We can't defend Copax. I don't oh, know. Should we? Martinez is the best. We can't defend Copax. So the best. Can so the best centre back. It's either no. It's either Copa. If we're conceding, it doesn't, if it doesn't matter the person, <coughs> if it doesn't matter the personnel we put in that position here, and we're still conceding Copax, then it's not a matter of the personnel. It's a matter of the system that allows Copax to be the one to use. It's not a matter of personnel. It's a matter of simply. So even system. like even before the even before the Cole Palmer goal. Like the last one, you literally considered a cutback if you didn't get like a last minute attacker. I think it was Mount or something that got it. Yeah, it was. Love that attacker. Like, yeah. like you would have considered another cutback then. Like, there's something going on in your system. I don't know if it's the manager or the players. System. I actually don't. I don't know. It's I don't know if it's the manager or the players. There is something going. Like, I know Chelsea are bad. I can admit that. Mm. But we are bad. We just we just keep playing bad. But they keep playing bad and somehow getting the results. Like, we're literally. <laughs> It's like our teams are similar, but we are losing and they are winning. You know what I mean? It's like the, we um, are no Chelsea are shocking, right? Yeah. United are shocking as well, but you win games. It's we play an NBA style system here, yeah, and we just happen to have better players in key positions that allow us to capitalize. But on it. you know that um, you do know that Chelsea are like five points behind you. We and you, we have a game in hand against them. <laughs> but you know you're not going to beat us. But let's just not let's just not do that. Are we going to do this again, man? Okay. Deja vu. What? That you say that you're going to beat us. And then you <laughs> but realistically speaking, if we didn't get those two-man sent off, we were beating you. Okay, but still, did yeah, you win? Yeah, we were. Yeah, actually, we were. Was, that game was live. That yeah, game? That, that game, like, realistically speaking, you weren't beating us. Yeah, you? but do you see how we do against the top six? Like, like you know what I mean? It's what we do against top, like, all the top six, like... Is that a good thing? Yes. That you can only beat the top six, but you can't. Remember, wasn't there a team in the Premier League back in the day that done that and still got relegated? Was Stoke. it Hull City? No, Stoke. There was a team like that that bet everyone in the top six, but couldn't beat anyone below them. I get, was it not Stoke? They made that 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 whole pitch hell. Was everything. it Stoke? I thought it was one. T- was it? I thought it was Hull. Are you sure? Ah, I can't remember. But um, no. So, but okay. So my my thing about oh, it was cold when I was watching that match, but. Um, my one thing about that match was very interesting. Was just like Tanag has been at United for how long now? Two years. Two seconds this year. For a manager not to make a team realize that you don't need to attack, just hold the ball, like go to a corner flag or like just don't play, kill, just hold kill was. Time very yeah kill time basically was very worrying because um yes people can say oh Dado shouldn't have done this and that but if Tanaka is screaming on the pitch don't kick that ball forward they won't be kicking the ball forward because during that whole game during that whole game like towards the end when he was telling yeah them, towards the end like did you not see him shut down at the time to just start to calm down same like, thing with Mats t- was saying calm down telling people to and calm down and no, tell it don't was, play forward are two different things no what do you mean don't play forward you, well, you're telling them to this, calm this, down this, well, why is it okay when it's tree tree Dalo is trying to score up and score. That's one way. That's how the goal did you, came. Did you see that counter That's attack. how the goal came. The okay. counter attack that Chelsea At did that there. point, Sam, there's only like what a minute left in the game. Okay, it's true, true. Let's take a point. Why are you going to attack? Yeah, I have questions for that. No, I, I but I'm saying, but I'm saying, something should have been like, don't kick that ball forward. Ten Hag should have said, don't kick that ball forward. You know, I, you know what I think the problem is with Ten Hag as well. I think he's, he thinks he's better than what he is. Yes. You see what is killing him as well. Remember that statement he made when we he are, came to well, uh, Man City and Liverpool are the eras are coming to an end. The eras are coming to an end. Go fuck yourself, man. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> how are you how even, are you saying that? And then losing like I didn't even say that. But someone who hasn't even played in English football ever. That last time he played the English team, man, you don't, they you knocked don't, him out of the Champions League. Man, you don't, the thing why is, was that Teta say? Why did Teta win before he came to Arsenal? But Teta never said that. No, no, listen, but listen, there's a thing. Why did he win before he what, came to He won the Premier League because he was a uh, Pep's assistant. Listen, 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 right. There's a difference between so, okay. confidence and then cockiness. This guy's a fool. Like, don't, like <laughs> this guy's a fool. Like, how can you say, like, with chest as well? He said, oh, this era is coming to end. Then you lose 
six three to my city and seven what it was seven nil to Liverpool. Are you fucking stupid? Like, do, do, do you hear what you're saying? Like, do we not? Are we being obtuse for on purpose? When Ten Hag was coming in, are we not going to act like? He wasn't this um, extremely touted manager. If we didn't get him, Tottenham would have gotten him. Okay. When that, <laughs> when um, he brought that Ajax team, unless and at the same time as well, who dealt with that Ajax team? It was it, at the end of the day. I was watching that match. It was still Tottenham, but he still mm. brought that Ajax team damn near to another Champions League final. And let's also be very, very guided. And before people start saying that, oh, but that Ajax team, look, look, well, well, if you check the league now, where's Ajax in, in the area? They said, they're not doing fantastic. Not doing well. but, no, see, so the for thing us is, to go and I'm start saying, saying all I'm of not, this I'm stuff not discrediting here. what you he are did. Discrediting. I'm not. No, no. That's Listen, discrediting. I'm not. You know what I'm doing? I'm not discrediting. He did a fantastic job with Ajax, but you must be stupid to think that an era is coming to end because literally, do you know who Pep Guardiola yeah, is? It's like, it's like, who do you think? Who do you think? Yeah. You, you see what when, when see there's a difference. Like you can compare that right onto when Jose Mourinho said, "I'm the special one." He was the special one. Didn't he win the league when he first came in? Yes, and he had one of the best defensive records of all... The best defensive so, record of all time. Yes, this is the... Com- now, go into this conversation. Fuck United anyway. Fuck whatever. This is a question I want to have for you, right? So, I was watching... That thing I said I wanted to do with you guys. And there was yeah. one question specific that came up. What team was better? The Invincibles team or Mourinho's team after that? I only lost one game. Like the Chelsea 05 team. The Chelsea 05 team. The team that never lost or the team that... That only lost one game. And he didn't lose a home game. And enough. like he, ba- he basically only conceded like nine, ma- nine goals that whole season. Well, has, there, has another team also played a season where they've only lost one game? Yeah. Has another team played a season where they've only lost one game? Yeah, Liverpool. What was it, Liverpool? Remember when they nearly went unbeaten? Um, and they lost to... Um, who was it again? Oh, who did Liverpool lose to? Watford. Oh, 3 0. It was 2 0. Sorry. It was 2 0. It was the last time Watford. And then Aston went to tweet. Sigh. <laughs> you can remember Liverpool went to go and defeat that season. Yeah, yeah. And they yeah. lost to Watford. That was. Um, like, because my, my, my thing about this whole Arsenal, you know, um, undefeated season, it is good. Let's not lie. Don't. Finally, you're back. What did you eat? What did you eat? <laughs> Not that ones that you have to. <laughs> <laughs> what did you eat? The blood. You know I have a cold and I can still smell that. That is disgusting. I touch you up. Move in a bit, guy. So uh-huh. move to the left a bit. Oh, sorry. Oh God, sorry, guys. We've had a lot of delays. A lot of. Disruption. Shit that have happened today. <laughs> <laughs> but um, um Yes, so I was actually put a question. Uh, well we'll get away from that for now. What were we talking about? Well, what were we even talking about? Um Arsenal fans. Yeah, Arsenal fans. Mm-hmm. What did you do you think they just overdo everything too much? Man, every little thing that Teta does they think that they they always uh, spout like is the next coming of um, Jesus. I swear to God. I swear. He, it's like everything he does is just brilliant. <laughs> it's it's the, you know how some people when they look at lyrics or raps, yeah, they they further read into it much more than the, than the it's person. Like when who, Dave drops the song. Yeah, people start they start connecting stuff like like that. This that like this is what Dave meant when he was putting this specific lyrical word before this word. When in true fashion, it's like I just thought it sounded nice. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. So and, and you see the thing as well like. Don't forget how our Twitter started at that club. Don't forget this guy was rubbish. Like he had some terrible seasons before he, before he got to this point. Three seasons was it? Three seasons. How many seasons has he been at Arsenal? Five years. Yeah. I yeah. Think so. And he's only been good the last two years now. People will say, "Oh, he's been building a team. He's been building a team." Yeah, but like, he's only won one FA Cup and one Charity Shield. Is that really? <laughs> A lot, like, and if he does, and if he doesn't win anything this year, even Mourinho in his shitty stint, he won a Euro- European Cup. Ten Hag won a League Cup last year, his first season. Yeah, that's a thing. Like, what? Pochettino's gotten to a f- possibly getting to two finals now. 
Like in the space of one season, like like so. This is where they will argue with me, but this is when I say, and I'll say it again: If Chelsea win that FA Cup and somehow finish sixth or seventh, they've had a better season than Arsenal, bro. Regardless, if well, the only reason, the only way Arsenal could have a better season than them is if they win the Champions, Champions League. League. Or yeah. they get to the final of the or, or, no, even if they get to the final. But know. even like I I know Bayern have a lot of missing players now on Tuesday. When they play against each other, they're gonna have a lot of players Who missing. Who are they missing? Uh, Sani. Kingsley Coleman. Kingsley Coleman. Um Nair is not there. Mm-hmm. I don't know if Goretzka is there. Uh, no, Goretzka's there. Um and I think there was someone else. There was yeah. a good list there to Sani, Kingsley Coleman and is Uber McCann injured? He could be well, yeah. yeah. There's a good few players injured for that match. But yet again, I still don't think they have an answer for them. Yeah, I, mean, no. I think defensively they they're weaker than how As- than Arsenal. So um, you know what the thing is, yeah. Uh, let's see how Harry Kane will deal with. Is Davis back, back? No. Yeah, forget. I think you see we just have to see how um Saliba is going to deal with Harry Kane. Yeah, so. but they are also going to deal with what? So because he was resting Saka, isn't it? So Saka, so, Martinelli. Are you on the Saka bandwagon? Let me see the the lineup today. I actually. think I think yeah, because me I'm I'm not of the mind of of Conting of Rich really waiting Saka like that. But I think in terms of just pure efficiency as a right winger, yeah, Saka is there. To the thing is right. Yeah. I'm so saying. better for Jesus. They're losing. Who? Bayern are losing to eleven place. Yeah, to Widenstein. Magic. I saw the equalizer. Okay, so Davies is playing. Um, Kim Min Jae is there. Kimmich is there. Upamecano Kano's there. Oh. Le- I think it's Lerm. L- 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 Lerman. Um, Goreska is there. Muller is there. Um, Musiala is there. Janabi is there. And Kane is there. Then there's Subs. May God have mercy. <laughs> hey! <laughs> we mew. What? I don't know some of these people playing Subs. They have Delit, Guerrero, Dyer, and then he gets. Gets foggy. And then they have that tell guy. Yeah. Chupa Martin. Yeah. <laughs> Daniel Pe- Jesu. You say that name. Daniel what? Perretes. Perretes. I'm Brian Zaga Zaga Dagados. Zagadagosa. Zagadagosa. Whatever it's called. Ha! Okay, maybe they might not be asked now. <laughs> Jesus. Nah, I, I, th- I think it was Nicky that even telling me. First of all, you know Muller was asking for Barca. And I don't blame him. By me, always be Barca. Nick, that's who my Barcelona, one of the Barcelona fans oh, I know. Imagine they did a 5 mil over them again. Against Barca? No, against, against Bayern. Barca. Bayern. Remember the last time they played Bayern, they got knocked out. Remember the act was 10-2? Yeah. Do you remember? That, that was when Douglas Costa was also bopping around. What a player. Cooked. What a player. <laughs> my, my money is on... Um, so, I, was, I, still think, I still think Bayern will get through. I don't, I don't know. I just feel like... Arsenal are going to do that whole thing where they're going to try to concentrate on the Premier League again. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Just gonna See, if I, was a, if I was a better man, I would say that City are going to win the Champions League again. Nah, I'll say Madrid. You know, you know if, we said if City win the Champions League again, do you think um, if City, if he wins the Champions League again, should he just retire? No, I want him to go national. I don't think he will. He said he wants to. And some people who are close to him as well that said that he wants to go on an international Where do you want to go? Man, I see, would, the thing is, what Pep would, would touch? What bad. Pep would do to England? They would win. Tri- I don't know what. <laughs> they would they win a treble and up, there's no such thing. <laughs> they would win, win World Cup Euros and then um, they should What's League. England? What he would do to England? <laughs> I'm even scared. Jesu. I like, have to see my friends. God forbid as well. <laughs> no, God forbid. What Pep if, cannot if, go to that French team. If Pep touches Mbappe, it's over for everybody. I'd love to see my France, Spain, and England. Because I want to just see if we can re- reach, if we can change Spain. Because I would love to see him with Yamal. Yamal, Pedri, Gavi. I'd love to see hey, him. Hey, what about Nico Williams? Don't forget my man. Sorry, Nico as well. I would love to see him play with them. Um, how we, we would sort them out. Even hey. the your man for associate that. <coughs> that's six. That they were even, people, so, Mamendi. Yeah, that everyone was. The tactical. Yeah, well, he's not going to touch Roger's position at all. Oh, lastly, before we go. Because yeah. that's wrapping up. Rodri. Yeah. What a player, guys! What a player! Sixty-four games unbeaten. And you know what's gonna happen? The game he's gonna lose is gonna be against Spurs. I promise you. Hey, you play, why are they playing Spurs again? Remember, it got rejiggered around because of the FA Cup. FA Cup. Wednesday again. You know they have to reschedule. Our match isn't even rescheduled yet. Isn't that now? 
That match could be played any time, at any moment, any given moment. Hope it's the last game of the season. It's going to be the last game of the season. They have to fit it all in. Yeah. Because they have to finish the season all in one day. Well, I remember what Demi said that if Rodri, if they, if Ch- City win the Prem and mm. the Champions League, mm. is Rodri going to win the Ballon d'Or? He has to. Like, there's no, I don't even want to hear it. I'm not listening to anybody else. If anybody tells me that anybody else should win the Ballon d'Or except Rodri, like, guy, then I don't what? know. What? Well, losing recipes. Well, losing re- SDM winning the Ballon d'Or. SDM. What are, losing, what, you, what are you saying? We're losing recipes. We're losing recipes. That's what we're, we're even doing. forgetting, right? We're that Rodri recipes. still has to play in the Euros with Spain. Yeah, if he performs there. If he performs play. there as well. So does Amape. I beg, man. If you're... Yo, if, did you I beg Amape? Yeah, fully. I did. What, Rodri? Did you, did okay. you hear what he said? Um, don't touch. Don't, don't even... 64. Do you say 64. 64 games in the... Demi, he, I begged Mbappe for the Euros. France don't win the Euros. Okay. And if England don't win, I'll, 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 I'll sack that man. England aren't winning those, bro. Southgate is not you the know, manager. And I, to be honest, I'll say Germany. For what reason? I would just say, just watch them. We watch them. Just be watchful of Germany. That's I because think they'll win. To be honest, yeah, words and Musiala is enough of a reason to watch out for Germany. Exactly. And have it. Uh, no. Yeah, have it as well. Sane. Sane. Ginabri. Ginabri. Kimmich. Goretzka. Right back. Gundo. Mm. Cruz. Mm. Rudiger. She Cruz is back. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Germany. Shut back. Because Germany now, they have two They have two good keepers. They have Ter Stegen and they have Nair. Shut the back, left back. Rudiger, right back. Oh, it's Shut It's Slutter Beck. Right back. Oh, Slutter back. Right back. <laughs> uh, Kimmich. Um, you have Gundogan, um, Cruz, and um, who else would they play in that middle? You need a DM. Actually, no. Cruz, Gundo, and Musiala. He's playing with two Musiala and Wirtz. Like two Kabbalah. I'd, say, I'd say put Musiala on the left <coughs> and put Wirtz in the middle. Uh, uh, on the right side. So I put him on the right cam. Who? I put Musiala on the left cam. Where would you, where would you put Sane? Put Sane. You can have you can have him to go more in in like a nine. What about Havertz? Havertz having a good season. Let's not let's not be let's not forget him. It's not every system. It's not every system that players will fit in. Into. I don't even know, man. I still I still I back Germany for the Euros. You no, know, we'll see who win the Euros, guys. That's a very that's a very interesting one. My thing is that Eddie said at the start of this podcast before we started here, he compared Waza and to who again? A girl. He said, and he was backing Aguero. What so did he say? Why well, he compared when you need to Aguero was backing him. He compared when you need to Suarez, he was backing Suarez. The disrespect. That Wait, there's nothing wrong with. Okay, the, this, the, the first one I understand. The second one, I don't even say. The disrespect that people have been throwing on when you need name. I I'm, not, even I'm think not disrespecting I, yeah, Rooney. Disrespecting Rooney. I'm not disrespecting yeah, Rooney. I'm not disrespecting Rooney. But Suarez was better. He wasn't better. He just wasn't better. And why? Just wasn't better. He wasn't as strong. He wasn't. Uh, it wasn't as good as a finisher. I don't care what you tell me. He wasn't as good as a finisher. It was in terms of. <coughs> in terms of, th- you want to know as well, yeah, because they're not. Th- they're not the type of strikers they both are. They're not the same. In terms of, um, how Harry Kane plays, yeah, Rooney is the archetype. Harry for Rooney ran, sorry, Rooney walked so Harry Kane can run. Those of archetype. <laughs> no, no, because if you watch Rooney. The way Rooney plays, the way he goes around the whole field. If Rooney specifically stayed to develop as a striker, I promise you, we won't be. This conversation wouldn't be had. Rooney so would played you say that Rooney was better than Harry Kane? Mind you, man came in at sixteen. Are we taking away trophies? Yes. Man came in at sixteen. Held grown men down in in career, the whole career. Again, started at 16, came I'll, in I'll, Everton. I'll, I'll take Kane's better, bro. First goal. First bomber clock. What? what? Yeah, okay. You forget there was a time Kane scored like 20. Kane has scored 20 plus goals. That's, every season. Okay. That's cool. In a shitty Totten team. Oh, look at the players this guy had around him. That's cool. That's you said Harry Kane over Rooney. Yeah. Why is that? I'm pretty yeah. sure he's overtaking Rooney as well in the top goal scorer for England. Why is that? You, 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 like, I know, I know the Rooney you're talking about. Let's, you're all sitting here like Harry Kane hasn't broken records week in week out. Like, 
It's literally his. He said we're not talking about trophy or another. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's not forget that this guy is the second most top goals in English football history, and the only reason why he didn't break is because he decided to go to Bayern Munich to try win a trophy and look at him now. Shameless. Who? King. I know it's shameless. <laughs> Kadim. That's what I'm saying. Say, well, I, Waza. I, are we going again off complete player? Because Kane. Waza has more complete player. Because to be honest, yeah, I'm saying I'd rather Kane, but you can't compare them to because they literally are the same type of player. Waza is more complete, though, in my opinion. For what reason? <laughs> well, no, let's do Are we doing this again? How is he more complete? No, what, what, no, 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 no. what because can he yeah, do that yeah. Kane can't do? That's the question. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, wait, answer wait, my will question. You answer, will you let me? Will you let me? No, will you, you, you let me break don't down? Do deflection, I'm not deflection. What I'm can he do that Harry Kane can't let me, do? Would you let me? Because, like I said, Rooney walked. Yeah, so Harry Kane can walk. Mm, I look, mean, run. Sam, the archetype that Rooney is, that's the same archetype. Sam, that Harry Kane I is asked you one question. I don't know why you can't answer a question. You, and you do this to a kind question. <laughs> what can Harry Kane do that Rooney can't do? No, what can Rooney do that Harry Kane can't do? Sorry, Rooney, yeah. Again, wrong opinion. Why is he's, he's gonna say something stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Rooney, in terms of as a as a striker, in terms of his completeness, I genuinely think as a finisher, he's better than Harry Kane. Harry Kane, uh, bro, as a fi- ball striking, yeah, Rooney. How can you say somebody from sixteen? How can you, how can you say somebody's better than somebody when the other, that person, other person, scored more goals from ball strike? Tell me. No, no, that bro, no, that's like that's like that's like me saying that's like me saying should I bust his brain? Should I bust his brain? And that's like my brain. <laughs> bust my brain. Bust my brain. Just Boom. remember, twenty plus goals each season. Boom. Um, Boom. before Boom. Sam did this, I want you to take his analogy for a minute. So Sam said that um, Rooney is a better finisher than Harry Kane. So is Ederson a better passer than KDB? I want to ask the question. What do you mean by that? Is Edison a better passer than KDB? Because what I'm trying to say is Edison is good at passing, yeah? Mm-hmm. So is KDB. Does that might mean Edison is better than KDB because they can both pass so balls Edison really well? in this situation is Rooney and then KDB Edison can King. Edison can pass the ball better than any United player. I just want to make that's that very clear. He can pass it better than Bruno. But yes, he can. Uh, I'm going to say he can. <laughs> Edison, Bruno! Edison can what pass the, f- the ball what the fuck? better than <laughs> what any. What the fuck? And I'll say Don't this again. Up. No, 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 no. He no, can't no. pass it better than Nana. Fuck off. No, he can't. No, the fuck he can't. Dan Nana. Fuck off. No, he can't. No, he can't. Oh, my God. No, the fuck. This is why, this, this why I said I wanted him back. Because he wants to come and piss me off. What do you mean? Are you are you high? fucking lost. Are you high? What so you can fuck off? No, you can fuck true. off. You actually you say you off. actually say something. Damn yeah. Bruno. You actually you man, the disrespect you man left you actually towards you, Bruno and you think I will sit down. I don't care. No, are you, no. are you mad? Are you trying to say I'll flip this no. whole thing upside down now? What? Flip it. Uh, what I'll are you? Oh, yeah, do it. I'll take my hands. I'll flip it. Don't let me activate. If I activate now, activate. If I activate now, first of all, I'll take my bank card. I'll just tap, 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 these people, I guess we mad. My face disappeared. Mad? How can you, how can you be saying I, that Bruno is that? Wait, how can you say something so stupid? What? Are you saying? What? No, wait. How the, br- the audacity of you two. The Bruno one, we can come back in a second. Yeah. But the Onana thing the is... Onana, are you stupid? Are you scumps? Are you mad? Are you mad? Sam, you're mad. What? Onana's whole career versus Edison's whole career. You're, you're telling me who's a better passer. You're telling me that. You're telling me that Onana... Edison, what? Are you taking the, both of you are taking the piss? You are taking your yeah, both of you are taking the piss. You are actually Did you know what you just said? You just said, wait. Did you say that Onana, oh, Onana oh, is a better person than Edison? Oh my Are you God. lost? You two are lost. What? You two are actually lost. This guy has been drinking some like alcoholic beverages. I can't take off my own top. But, yeah, you you're telling me, you're, t- you're telling me, you're telling me, Sam, Sam something Sam, Sam, that Sam. Pep himself, yeah, had to put into his plan just because of how good of a passer that Onana was in the final. You're telling me he's not better than Edison. What final? The final that you lost. I'm talking about the, the final, final of Inter, Inter Milan. Inter. I'm talking about whole careers. But that what are we talking about? That does not mean that he's a better passer, passer than him. Like what the hell? Are you stupid? Are you hearing? Just because he he's changed a, his tactics for a goalkeeper does not mean he's better than fucking Edison. That doesn't make sense. He's a passer. How? Where? Where are you seeing this? 
Are you taking the fucking piss? So, you know what, yeah? Oh you know my what, yeah? God. This is where, and this is where, yeah, I said that. My dude is even making me hot. This is where, <laughs> this is where, oh, what are you saying now? This is where this, I say, this is where I say, you two, you will let bias against United Kingdom. No bias. No, they no, no, they're no, they're stupid no, and they're smart. No, I didn't they, say Edison can pass the ball better than No, no. There's a difference between there's a right and there's a wrong. Yeah, you're wrong. You two, let me tell you something. Any team. And then you want to, yeah, you want to, I understand. You know what? I understand. Let me tell you something. No, I don't know. Let me land. Let me land. There's no Oh. I would even say Edison can pass the ball better than most every single Chelsea player. Listen, Ewo. Yes, he can. Okay, you know what? <laughs> We're not going to that. Why? Let's Wait, cook it. That Enzo. Cool. That, that Enzo. Oh, now he says it. Cool. Listen, yeah. Let's see what you want to listen, say. Listen, listen. This is just Onada oh and Edison. Oh my god. You know what? Yeah, and this is and this is where I say truly and truly, I'm also I'm also grateful as well mm -hmm. because you get the biases there because my United. On that frequency, we have traumatized you too. It's okay. We have this Man United supporters. Oh it's my okay. God! This is coming from a point of trauma. That also, I just want to make something very hate. clear. I just want to make something. Have, Chelsea have been better than United over in this now 20th century. Chelsea have been a better team than you. You do realize that, right? Because it, compared to well, when Alan Ferguson was in twenty years, Chelsea in, when, in the last. With when Cope. Ferguson Go was there. At, oh, no, we're not talking about history. I'm talking Go about, about Because our prime year, yeah, compared prime to primes. Look at no, this. No, no, no. Prime 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 no, before, before no, we go no, into no. that, prime listen, he said, let me land. You are landing at Uganda <laughs> Airlines. <laughs> I swear to God. Because he's switching <laughs> the What are you topic? talking about? Because he's switching the topic. No, no, no. no. Did you not interrupt me? You just said. Did you not interrupt me? You just said. You just said that. Did you not interrupt me? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care about the history. I don't care about the history. Wait, will you let me land? You said Onana's a bad person. Yes. That's what we're talking about now. Because you, you, are you, 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 ah, you are using bias. You are using bias. You are using bias. Are you hearing yourself? What? Are you hearing yourself? He was literally the most touted ball playing goalkeeper oh, last season. Up. He comes to United all of a sudden. Oh, 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 oh. Really? Guys, what are we all you about? Are telling me that the, no, he is guys, literally. Sam, he was said, literally Sam, touted. Sam, 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 yeah. Okay. He so was now, before let, he let came into United. Mm -hmm. He was touted as one of the as the one of the best, if not the best, ball playing goalkeeper out there. And when okay. it comes to United, all of a sudden your opinions have now okay, changed. Okay, wait. One of the best because he was if under not, Edison. If, That's it. I Isn't said it? one of the best, if not the best. If people are going to say a ball playing goalkeeper here, like, pre oh, before this season started, before he went to United, if people are going to say ball playing goalkeepers, who are the best ones here? People, and there's not going to be an order to this. Run those two. Onana, Edison. And let me see. let me take another one. Uh, we can even, we really have uh, add Edison into that conversation. Ball playing. Sam, are you literally hearing what you're saying right now? You man, yeah. No, Sam, like, I, no, I just need you to realize. That's, you said, you said. You, anytime it comes under a shade of red, Sam, all of a sudden, Sam, I, like, I, all of a sudden, it goes I, out I, the window. Maybe, yeah, look, okay, wait. Let me, I want to actually make, this is not about me being biased. I'm actually being very honest. I would say Edison can pass the ball better than a lot of players in that Premier League. I mean, a, a lot, lot of clubs. Even, a even lot, just in the top a six. A lot. A lot. Even top six. Fam, the fact you are sitting here, Trying to think we're being biased. Sam, Edison is one of the best, if not the best, ball playing goalkeeper we've seen. That is and why he was bought into City. The guy doesn't hoof, even if the guy hoofs the ball. Is a tactical it's hoof. An assist. Remember the assist he's doing against Spurs for Gundogan? <laughs> yeah. And even me, I have, to, I have to slag my own team. Even against, remember against Brighton? Brighton. When, he, when he did that for Haaland. And, 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 I'm, and I'm not trying to say, okay, this is the only two, but in general, this guy is the best ball playing goalkeeper in the league hands down don't do the onana thing compared <laughs> to him because if i say something now you run mad if you want me to really make you run mad i can make you run mad i want him to run mad who said i could say vicario is a better ball passer than m edison and not edison but m onana vicario yes he is <laughs> no the guy just, okay. i don't watch spurs enough like Th thank you so he doesn't even watch spurs enough but he knows i watch united all the time because i always call him every time united lose why so are you looking at me you people. No, you are trying no, to come here and say that Onana. You people. Like Onana hasn't made how many mistakes has Onana made this season from trying to pass the ball out? You see, you see what I'm. And this is where I'm. This is where oh. in, in when the recordings you spotted as well. When you listen to my wording carefully, you man, yeah. W I, when on, I literally came on the podcast and even said, this, "United, we signed Onana way too, way too early in our project. Way too early because our team, yeah. How would you have signed him then? How old is the guy? I'm, I'm talking about the role. 
in terms of a Paul playing goalkeeper role because we can say the hell isn't is it? <laughs> that's true. So just as a bob because most or are you gonna say most top teams don't have a ball playing goalkeeper or their keeper is capable of playing now? There's only at the moment there's only City hundred percent Arsenal Arsenal there is Spurs there is um, Villa. Liverpool as well, because Alisson, as well. Newcastle as well. Even if, it, because Pope here, yeah, wait, 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 will you let me land? Pope here, yeah, even if he's not go his feet, he can fucking throw. And that's a, and that does the same even job. Pickford as well. Pickford. Pickford. Oh, see, Pickford is a ball playing keeper in the wrong team. <laughs> yeah, that's like, so you know, true. People, people will be saying, so true. when is Pickford going to get his opportunity? And I'm like, he can't. I said, there's no he can't. There's no, uh, the, only, the only place you can go to is Chelsea, sorry. Yeah, that's true. The only place you can go to is Chelsea mm. or Villa if Martinez retires. And mm. uh, sorry, and those teams here yeah, again, like it's, fuck, even Martinez as well is more comfortable. Uh, um, it just his overall composure as well for Aston Villa has him just been a better ball playing goalkeeper. Those pe- those teams that all of the teams I've listed here, in terms of their projects, they are far ahead of them in our own projects than we are. That's why I said that we signed them too What's early, happening? and because of that, yeah, it is causing you guys not to see the light that you are now seeing. Um, Onana, yeah, you have it, like that's why I say okay, maybe the bias isn't the right word, but he has caused you to ha- to see him in a different way, brother. Before he came to United, he again touted in terms of the best ball playing goalkeepers. He's there. That's literally what Onana is telling for. He's not better than Edison. That's what we're trying to get to your head. And what I'm trying to say is, if you're is, saying that, if you're saying that right now, that means you're saying Onana is the best ball playing keeper in the league. And if you're saying that, you're saying that Onana is one of the best ball players you've ever seen. And you want to know, I want to know that thing. Because I still don't think that what Onana has done with this team, Edison does that. I don't think he does that. I just don't think he does oh, that. Oh, fuck off, man. You're just taking a piss. You know what you... pissed me off about what you just did now? Why could we not, why could we not this have done? Oh, my God. You know, see, you know when you dig, you when you dig a hole when we talk about United players, you just dig deep, 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 deep. You just say, do you hear I'm what you're saying? I'm not going to just sit here, yeah, and let you man just chat shit about. We're, we're, we're not chatting even chat shit. No, because we're telling no, you the truth. No, no because my man is saying, my man is saying Edison was better than Bruno in terms of passing the ball. What are we talking about? <laughs> <laughs> and you think I'm? What are we talking about? I'll stick on that. What are we talking about? Passing the ball better than Bruno. That's if that. And you think that with that type of opinion, yeah, I'll just go and sit here. Okay, let's okay, let's let's just say I'm moving delusional with that opinion, yeah. That's me moving delusion. I can admit that I'm okay. Mad. The Bruno one was a bit mad, but on the other one was mad. Shut up! You are you shut up! Shut up! Don't, don't say it again. Don't do that again. No. So if you're, right now, yeah, top three ball playing goalkeepers in the world. Fuck the league in the world. Who is in that tree? Number one is Edison. One hundred percent. Number, number two is the person that uh, this this Nair. Number t- Neuer and then number three is Ter Stegen probably. Because mm-hmm. that's what they have to do. They don't. They, have they to play. They, they, exactly. don't, they don't hit the ball. Like. <laughs> so last year, Onana was. That's this year is not. Okay. No, let me not test twisted. I've okay. seen on, Onana. Kibon, I know. I, I see what okay. Onana. Does. Onana can kick ball. Onana well. kick ball. Like that's all. Onana was the best ball playing go- goalkeeper out of Italy. He's not making it into your top three. Cool. No. Cool. No, not, you ask. You, so cool. you had to want to determine my top three. Cool. Yeah, I'm not. I'm saying it's not. Me, are you telling me you're, you're the same person that sat here and only want to say that Lissandro Martinez is better than Van Dijk? And you calling me delusional? I admitted it, Diana. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Diana, I admitted it. How many, people, that, how many people did he try to t- say that Martinez this nigga was, was going to say? I'm, I, I wasn't you know, like, he was even doubling down in the comments. You <laughs> think I didn't focus on that? <laughs> yeah. He was doubling down in the comments. <laughs> like, don't piss me off. Sam. So, no, because you might have supported me in there. And you see my points. The Bruno thing is mad. But mm-hmm. you know yourself, Edekin. I admitted that Martinez I, was mad no, as well. The Bruno thing is mad. But what I'm basically trying to say is maybe I should... Edison can pass the ball better than a lot of players in our own teams. Mm. Let's I, not sit here and say I'm that. Even say, bro, I'm, oh my God, man. Bruno, Bruno is mad. Okay, Bruno don't have no, <laughs> and, and this is and, and this is where I'm, uh, again, it really it really breaks my heart here. And I know a, man, a lot of my United supporters can also agree. A lot of the players that we rate and we generally really rate here, and when we try to bring them up in conversation, and people just shoot us down and do the whole lot. Like because, who? because, as, my no, as, because as a whole here, the way you, the way people and team just view United, it just causes them to see them. Is it just that. is it just money that you see that? Who who else has Dalo? That was this bad Dalo, game. Okay. Top. Wan Bissaka. Top. Okay. Varane when he's not been injured. Top. But we can say that about every team. Sam. You can say that about a load of people. Like you can say that about even just talking about Chelsea. You can say that about Gusto. Gusto's been better than Dalo. You see. 
That's just crazy. That's how he has. He hasn't. <laughs> That's just crazy. He hasn't. In his first season as well. Well, I like, I'm not going to lie to you. Been. I watch all your games because I want to ring you and slag you. So mm. don't take it like I don't watch mm. your games. Dalo has been... Dalo has been better. Dalo has been good. This Dalo, season. right back, left back. He's done, bro. bro he's, he's had to do it by force. It's not yeah, like but I'm <laughs> saying, it's also by force, but the fact that he's still able, he consistently perform. Chelsea game here, maybe he's over, overused or whatever the English is. Um, and as, as that's this one game, that's his one or two bad games. I can say that he's had this whole season. If not, he's dropped minimum what eight. What happened? Brentford are winning 3 2 against um, Asta. Villa. Okay. What? Yeah. Brentford? Yeah. That's the final with Tony Lope, man. Yeah. Who's yeah. going for Brentford? Tony. Uh, Tony didn't start. Tony, y- y- Jorgensen, um, Bueno, and Wissa. Bueno, uh, Bueno is a baller. Them two, you know. Bueno's only like 23, you know. <laughs> yeah. But back to this, right? See, you see, you see that United team, like, you're saying that we don't see that the players that are good on your team, whatever. But you're, you're using, you do that to other teams as well. You get me? No, me, I, I'm, I can admit when certain players are good. Okay, but literally, you haven't watched Enzo Fernandez. I can year. admit Enzo is good. Well, like I said, just because because we can use that. No, 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 I can also admit. That. There's actually been a stat about him that's like pretty, like, been one of the best. It's not like it's. It was like, passing, is it? It's like passing or yeah. passing. And so. I watch, no, I <coughs> for one, every time I've I had the chance to watch. Chelsea play and Enzo's play. He's one of, been one of the more consistent performers. Caicedo as well. The last day here, when Caicedo was taken off, when the substitution was being made and Choco Omeka was coming on here, and then Chaloba, he brought Chaloba and uh, Gilchrist. Gilchrist on. Eddie was like, what the fuck is he doing? I'm like, no, you don't understand what and you, I, and what I you answered lost this, and I answered in Caicedo right. coming off. Yeah. I under, Caicedo defensively here was doing the job for Chelsea. Okay. I understand what Caicedo See, do. Because I, I also watched right. Caicedo at Brighton. Let me let me tell you something, right? You know why I said ah he doesn't know what he's doing. I've seen Chuka Mecca play this year, I think four or five times. That's why I was like, why is he coming on, right? I know he's a good player, yeah, but I've seen him play five times. Chaloba has played, I think that was his third or fourth game now this season, and Gilchrist has just been playing in the FA Cup and Carabao mm-hmm. Cup. That's my reasons behind that. Oh, it's true, true. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. That Premier League, man. What the hell? But what, what I'm trying to say is that I don't get me wrong. That, yes, I might be a bit um, delusional. Not even. I'm not. You I, are I, very deluded. No, it's not. That's you not. Are the, deluded fan. not there's a word for it. Is when you are exaggerating. Um, I forgot. Sarcastic. No, I that too. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Why is thinking of his word? Oh, hyperbolic. I can be a bit hyperbolic in, in how Just I go. Just boy and big boy English. Oh. Hyperbolic. I've never heard of that word before. <laughs> God, English. Anyways, all of the. <laughs> I, I'm, I I will exaggerate here and there, yeah, but that, that's because I'm just. It's, it's football, and we're talking about something we're passionate about. So we're going to get lost in it. It happens to you, it does. It happens to you, and it happens to him. It, it's normal. But what I'm trying to say that I can't very much repeat. Brother, Huming Son, yeah, in terms of wingers, yeah, was what was one of my favorite wingers I've ever seen. When I went to Tottenham, I was heartbroken. Well, God sees my heart. Well, God sees my heart. When he was at Leverkusen, yeah, I've been watching him since he was at Leverkusen. 25 million. I could. Great. When I said, and for 25 million, at the time of Bono, he was. Yo, yo people keep forgetting. Daniel Levy is a crook. I've said this so many times. I was even seeing, was it you that sent me the interview? Oh, the thing about, they said, they said that, they hate dealing with him. They said the three teams that they hate dealing was, was with Peterborough, Watford, and Tottenham. Oh, they said man. they one day walk into a meeting with Tottenham saying they want to buy a player. And Danny Levy says, basically said that you want my player, you're not going to decide the price I am. Or you can walk out. Chai! <laughs> I, you, that's why I said he's my crook. So if the guy has that mentality when it comes to his players, when he goes to another club, I, went, I looked, you know, there's one thing, I, one thing, by God's grace, obviously, this episode hasn't been our best episode. Yeah, it's yeah, been yeah. a bit messy. Yeah. But there's one thing that when we, by God's grace, when we get better, when we get, when we get there, I love to see. I love to go on and see how no- negotiations happen. Yeah, I love yeah. to see how negotiations go on. I want to see more of the back, um, the the back door yeah. sort of. Stuff. I love to actually sit a podcast down with an owner and an agent and a. Player. I want to actually know like what goes on. What goes on? Because obviously I know Sky Sports told yeah. something like yeah. that, but it didn't show me like. Though I want to see like. How they go on about it? Like? How they go on about it? Like, how they... Because I obviously seen like, how... It's actually very interesting how they value a player. 
is it's like very more in depth than we actually think. Yeah, I know. Do what I think one of the ones I want to see, especially, was how Enzo was bought because he was bought at the last hour of the January sale. Yeah, but apparently there's a, apparently there's like a there's like if like when there's a big price tag on a player like mm. that, there's like a middleman who will pay the money and then they'll be yeah, close because, back yeah, to yeah, like yeah. Low, very yeah. low interest. Wait, so, yeah, yeah. What happened? So, so say for example, there's who's a big transfer? Like let's think about Premier League transfer. 100 million or something. Like, like let's like say like Bellingham. Belli- no, Bellingham. Rice. Right, when Rice right, wants so to yeah. go to um, Arsenal. Mm. Let's say Arsenal are like, okay, we'll pay you this money because, you know, realistically speaking, they don't pay for players. Like when the price is 100 million, they don't actually don't pay that 100 million straight away. Mm. Yeah. They might say, okay, give us 50 million off from the 20 million for the next three or four years. So what happens is, I love to know, like, because sometimes the clubs may not have that 50 million as of yet. So there's like mm. a middleman who yeah, that pays that money for them, yeah, yeah. but they pay back the loan with very low interest. Mm. Okay. So yeah. like, it's like, it's like, oh, this club are saying, because at the end of the day, you know, football is football, but banks are banks. You can't just. Yeah, but. Just and, and, and like, I work in a, where I, I know that, I know that because where I work, they've transferred millions before and it costs a lot of money to transfer millions immediately. Yeah. So if you get these man to say, oh, we'll pay them the money instead, they can do it. Because obviously I say they're connected with it. Sorry, what do you want to say before? But I, yes, well, well, one, I, I agree with that here because likewise, also in a similar industry and I, I, I understand where it's coming from with that. But I I might sort of think that I would also love to see I would love to see the scouting process. Scouting. The scouting process. They add the, the whole this, the whole um scouting process. How in depth because a uh, system and the metric um, or sorry I saw a soft software that they use that is actually pretty accurate in terms of scouting. You know football manager the game. Yeah. The whole system behind it is actually very accurate. It, it's very in depth and I think a couple of teams actually well, have used it to pick up. what I because look I'm 28 years old. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm not gonna sit here and be like you know, shame or anything. I know there's people that have done it. I've paid to go to trials before. From what I understand about the scouting system, they all have something they're looking for. Mm. So like, it's like, maybe they might come <coughs> to a club and say, well, look, maybe like, they might have the notes. We're looking mm. for a fast, mm. agile, mm. you know, box to box like mm. how fit he is like is he a good finisher how does he like read the game they have their notes and from what i understand is like that's what they look for mm. but like basically from what i understand it's how does he read the game and what attributes does he have i want to see that in depth because for my own picking when my own picking comes to this world now when i'm preparing him now so that i know from scouting reports i'll just but at the same time so just as a football player and a football fan i want to know because ju- from the scouting reports, how they scout them, how they view, what they value at certain different age groups, I want to see really in depth into how that I is. Don't, don't, I love to see. You know when they get a player that's old, like old. Yeah. I want to know like why did they go get that player? They're, they definitely must value the softer skills rather than the harder skills being like that. Let me tell player. you something. Yeah. As much as all these Premier League players are doing all this madness, I promise you, the one thing they all value is a streetwise footballer, like your Jamie Vardy. You know, there's another, there's a centre back as well. That I think he's in Italy that didn't get picked up till like he was 27, 28. Is it? Yeah. There's a couple of footballers that get picked up very, very late. Yeah. But that's just more because they're street smart. Yeah. You know, there's there's different. Yeah, you're Premier League smart, but there's street smart football. Jamie Vardy is hashtag number one. <laughs> Jamie <laughs> Vardy is ah. Uh, he was a crook, man. <clears throat> Funny thing is, though, because people, because he was playing, was it not, was it non-league? Was playing for mm. a while. The guy was um when he was younger, yeah, he was yeah, talented as a big talent as well. Yeah, Jamie, was Vardy, a pro- Jamie Vardy didn't make it till like 20... Yeah, 22, 23. No, Jamie Vardy was old when he made it, it was like 24, 25. Yeah, I was gonna say, but the thing is, that the people have been, he said that he just never, the thing is that he didn't believe in himself enough. It's not that he wasn't in those opportunities or those chances. Like, he, now he has the Premier League to his name, which <laughs> he, I think he has the longest um goals, um, consecutive goals scored. In that record, he has a 13 or something, which is insane, it's absolutely insane. insane. That Leicester squad, what a dream! That season, Sam, what a dream! I swear, I'm still, I'm still trying to, still thinking about that whole Edison and Lamy thing. That's your own personal something, but I do agree in terms of the next time you said that, I'll my apology. <laughs> 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 Let me see, but yeah, what were you saying, sorry? Nah, but I, I do agree. I would, I, I actually love to see how football negotiations go. I love to see how the scouting elements of football. I would genuinely love to see how the really the back end of it really would go. I actually, I'd love it. God knows, yeah. I, I'd love to. I'd love when we get to that point. I'd love to to really get. Yeah, my God's grace will get to that point. I mean, this. I mean, 
Um, look, guys, I'm pretty sure we're all tired. Especially, I can even like I can see on this the moment when we were all arguing. <laughs> like it's just all. I'll show you now, <laughs> guys. We're all tired, and one phone is turned off because the storage is full. So we thank you for getting this far. It's been a bit messy. We've had mm. power cuts. We've had someone have the shit. That was a liar. Yeah, that was a liar, <laughs> but we got through it. I'm probably gonna have to cut up a lot and stuff, so yeah. I'll probably make it a shorter and try to make everything like. Yeah, sure. Well, it'll be a short together. episode. Yeah. But um, I try to do my best with it. But guys, thank you for making it this far. And look, we'll be back again in the next two weeks. Love, love, love. And um, hopefully, 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 we can get agree and disagree. I just have to figure out how I'm going to do it in here. Which I think will even be more heated than anything we've ever done. <laughs> because that's going to be crazy. Honestly, we thank you guys. And look, we'll chat to you in two weeks. Take look, care. Yeah. Talk to you later. Stay safe. Bye.